Logan Paul has released a 15-minute documentary satirically trolling the Flat Earth Society, and the internet thinks it's comedy gold. You're watching What's Trending, and I'm Andy Lawani. Don't forget to like and subscribe for social media news daily, and follow me along on social media at Andy Lawani if you're really that bored. Now, if you don't know, Logan Paul is a YouTube creator who, despite coming up against public backlash in 2018, has come back swinging. The internet went crazy after Logan Paul was spotted at the Flat Earth International Conference in Denver on November 15th, publicly declaring his faith in the theory. And while some thought Logan was serious, others, like me, were calling it BS. And now, Logan has released a 50-minute long documentary, which shows Logan interviewing those who believe the Flat Earth theory and expressing his interest in traveling to Antarctica to visit the edge of the world. Man, Robbie, I just don't know what to believe anymore. <sighs> Logan talks to attendees at the Flat Earth Convention, goes on a date with a Flat Earth believer, and even interviews kids. Not lying. How do you know that? They can't lie to millions of people. Seems pretty far-fetched, huh? And this brings us to the conclusion that Logan is totally trolling us. Uh, uh. One user said, when did Logan Paul become a comedy god? And Freezy added, can't even lie, this Logan Paul flat earth doc is absolutely hilarious. It's really well done, fair play. Logan Paul must have taken some tips from Shane Dawson because this is actually Pretty decent. And while the Flat Earth Society may not be too happy with the parody, a lot of us are actually like relieved that Logan Paul isn't a believer. Because despite there being abundant scientific evidence and photographic proof of our Earth being a round planet, this subset of people strongly believe the Earth is flat. And while like a lot of us can just like roll our eyes and just like scurry on to something else, it actually kind of worries a lot of people because it reveals a deeper issue. Conspiracy and pseudoscience channels have long been able to thrive under YouTube's old content guidelines, and many of these videos are recommended by YouTube's algorithm. In 2017, a study conducted by Ashley Landrum at Texas Tech University surveyed 30 attendees of that year's Flat Earth International Conference and found that 29 people credited YouTube's videos to changing their views. The study also also noted that most of the group previously watched conspiracy videos about 9-11, Sandy Hook, and whether NASA really went to the moon before YouTube's algorithm recommended flat earth videos. But YouTube has actually started to crack down on these conspiracy videos. In January, YouTube announced they would begin reducing recommendations of borderline content and content that would misinform users in harmful ways. Now, I'm a big, big fan of conspiracies and love those kind of videos. First to click on that Shane Dawson release, but I do think some regulations should come on conspiracies just to make sure that no false information or false content comes through. Now the real question is, do you think Logan Paul's video is diminishing this flat earth theory or exposing it even more to all of the masses? Let us know in the comments down below and uh, give us your thoughts. And be sure to like and subscribe for more What's Trending. You can also check us out on Roku, Amazon Fire, and Apple TV.